Farniak the snap. Martinez will fake the handoff, throws over the middle. That's caught across midfield. Not near the 45-yard line. Drake Anderson, the starting tailback. Isaiah Bowser out with an upper body injury. It's a little flip pass. So this is the tight end, John Rain, as a first down. Out across the 30-yard line. On fourth and one, it's Anderson. It's a cutback, a first down and more. And then is upended inside Huskers territory out near the 42-yard line. It's Anderson again. That hole opens up. Anderson slips three. Down the sideline. Anderson 10-5. And he is going to be in for a touchdown. It's one of those guys made a lot of plays for a long time. On second down, Martinez has time going deep to the sideline. That's caught inside the 50-yard line down to the 48-yard line by Austin Allen. The transfer LSU connected on 22 against Ohio State. This one from 38. It's on the way, and that one is right down the middle. And Nebraska's on the board on the Connor Culp 38-yard field goal. And second down off play action. Deep ball down the middle, and it's tipped in the air, and it's intercepted. Miles Farmer off the deflection. Farmer inside the 45, and that ball might have come out again. Nope. Markel Dismuke made some plays against Ohio State. That was a big pass break. Second pick thrown by Ramsey, and now wide open down the sideline. That's Marcus Fleming. Scott Frost said this week that his freshman wide receivers are really coming around, and Fleming is in that group. Martinez off the pump. Running out of time, still looking downfield, slips away once. Martinez keeps his feet moving and is brought down near the 10. That'll be a first down. They'll mark him down at the 11. 36 yards out, and that one is good. So off the turnover, third and five. To Ramsey and Northwestern. He'll throw, tight coverage intercepted. Down the sideline. Here's Farmer again. His second pick of the day nearly took that one back, setting up first and goal for Nebraska. Mills the tailback behind Martinez. It's Mills up the middle, driving, powering, and Mills stretching for the goal line. He's in. Touchdown, Nebraska. It's a gain of nine. Pressure coming from Ramsey behind him. That ball is out, and that's loose on the field. Reimer might have it. Reimer came in from behind. Nope, Northwestern got it back. Jesse Brown, the tailback, had two rushing scores last week. Second and goal from the two. They fake it to Brown. Ramsey throws to the end zone. And that's caught. And a touchdown for John Rain. On third and eight. Again, pressure to the sideline. Wide open. That's a catch and a big hit on Bryce Kurtz. But he hung on to it. Out of bounds. And a first down for the Wildcats. All out near the 26-yard line. Martinez goes his way and stand will run again. Another running lane. Martinez inside Northwestern territory. I hate like Martinez, whether he's in space or not, he's slippery. Martinez rolling, looking, firing towards the end zone, up for grabs, and that's intercepted. Once again, Brandon Joseph strikes. Defense, no points allowed in the second half. More than 90 minutes dating back to last year. How about this play? McCaffrey in trouble, still being pressured, and McCaffrey throws it away as he was going down to the ground back inside the 10-yard line. So Elise will look into that sunshine. Good punt. For Krista, Elise, the catch, the step, and here he goes. A great cut, breaking ankles inside Nebraska territory. A 56-yard pump, but a 33-yard return for the senior from Libertyville, Illinois, and Riley Lease. Second and goal. Ramsey throws underneath. There's a catch, a spin, diving for the end zone. Riley Lease is in for a touchdown. Order in motion. McCaffrey throws that one, tipped and intercepted. Another deflection, and that leads to a pick. And Chris Bergen comes up with it. First 3-0 start since 2000 for the Cats. 
As Ramsey takes a knee, and the Wildcats are still undefeated atop the Big Ten West, a 3-0 start.